Hi everyone! We are going to make a color block top with top stitching. I have created a top similar to the picture. If you want to learn how to make a crop top with an O-ring, check the link at the top. Are you ready? Let's go! First, I'm going to create internal lines on the top. Go to the 2D window option, click Internal Polygon Line, and create two internal lines like this. Also, create two horizontal lines. I'm going to cut the horizontal lines first. Click the line and select Cut and Sew. Next, make the pattern for the top stitch. Select the rectangle and click once in the 2D window. I'm making the width 10 inches and the height 0.3 inches. You can adjust the size for your preference. Copy one more of the same pattern. And I will sew this top pattern onto the top. Click Segment Sewing and sew them together. Before we simulate, place the pattern closer to the top. When you're ready, simulate. Next, we are going to create the vertical part. In the same way, Select all the lines together by pressing Shift and clicking. Right-click and select Cut and Sew. Then, all the parts are separated and sewn. Next, I will create the outline of the vertical top part. Select the line, right-click, and select Offset Pattern Outline. Set the distance to the same size as your horizontal top stitch height. Click Default Corner and then OK. Then, you'll see a blue dotted line. Right-click anywhere on the pattern and select Unlock All Baseline. Then click Trace on the right options and select the blue line again. 
the blue line will change to an internal line. When you select the line, the baseline will still show up. You can select and delete it. Now we can create the cut and sew. But the additional pattern that we made is sewn with the top part, so we need to unsew it. Select Edit Sewing. Delete the sewing line with the stitched part and re-sew it with the original top part. Simulate again and you'll see the part is separated. Do the same with the others. Next, we are going to add top stitching. First, double click on hardware and trims. Then select top stitch. Choose the top stitch that you want. Select the segment top stitch in the 2D window. and click on the outermost line of the pattern. I'm going to add it to the bottom line as well. Select the top stitch. You can move this top stitch's location by 1/8 to 1/16. and also change the width of the top stitch. I'm going to make it thicker, so change the thread thickness to 60.
If you want denser threads, you can increase the SPI options. I'm going to apply the fabric Cotton 14 by dragging and dropping it. Add a new fabric. Drag and drop the fabric you want. Select the patterns you want to apply. And then, you can change the color. I want to change the top stitch color. So select the top stitch, scroll down, click color, and change it. Then, we are going to create a loose effect at the edge of the top stitch. Click on the outline of the top stitch, turn on elastic, set the strength to 10, and adjust the ratio while simulating.
Finally, we have made a color block top with top stitching. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.